Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna do a little look today. So I don't have anything planned, but I'm kind of just gonna go with it. Um, so I already did my makeup, but I did my makeup and I have my inner corner highlight on right now. So please ignore that. So we're gonna start out with some tape. This is how I get like my extreme like crisp line. So I'm just gonna kind of go along my lower lash line with that on both sides. Oh, there's a bug. Okay. Oh, my longer my lower lash line, not to go like too high. All right. So we're gonna go with that. I grab my Prism palette. I'm gonna grab Unity and kind of just go all over my lid with that. I'm gonna use the trusty Jaclyn Hill palette. It's really dirty, but who cares? So, I'm gonna see what kind of look I wanna go for. A look. So, I'm actually gonna grab this yellow shade, kind of put it in my crease. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kind of bring it up to the front, not completely up to the front but kind of like right here and then go along to here and kind of bring it down and we're gonna add this orange shade um, and then kind of just bring it more into my crease just adding some depth to that kind of doing the same motion we're going in here but also bring it out into my crease. Oop, that's pigmented. Then I kind of, I'm gonna dip back into the yellow and then go over the edges of that so that it kind of fades more. I'm gonna grab my Born to Run palette by Urban Decay. I'm gonna dip into Hollow Red, which is that purple shade and then kind of go and deepen it up more in my crease, my outer crease. So next we're gonna go ahead and kind of cut the crease. Grab the Tarte Maracuja Creaseless Concealer. I'm just gonna show you guys what I did. So I grabbed some. Do you see that whole crease area right here on my lid? So underneath that crease area, I'm going to fill that in with some concealer. Just going to follow that look up so that it transfers. And then I'm going to continue that part all the way up to that crease. And then what I'm going to do is just bring it like halfway, leave it how it is, but then turn it on its side and then add those jagged edges so that I can make the appearance of it blending into that. Go into this palette. I kind of want to grab a mixture of this one and this one. So I'm going to add that on, kind of pack it on. It probably would be a little bit better with just my finger, but I don't want to do all that extra stuff right now. I'm going to grab my fluffy brush again, dip into this shade again, and then just go over that. So it kind of blends in to the shimmer into Hell Ride. And then dip into that and kind of add depth to that and then kind of blend it out as well into that color as well. Kind of dip into Guilt Trip and Jet again. And then add a little bit more depth into the very, very end of it and not really blending it out. Kind of just keeping it in there but also blending it into the other color. So it looks really good. I'm going to take this off to kind of reveal the shape so crisp and put the yellow shade underneath and kind of put it underneath your eye 
I'm going to add this one underneath as well. I'm going to put some lashes on. Put, I'm going to put the There Real on for Benefit. I already have some on from earlier, but I kind of just want to coat my lashes one more time. Grab my trusty lashes from Ilore, the Silk Lashes in Marquise. So this is the final look. Thanks guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. Alrighty. So I'm kind of probably going to go in with the pink. Probably. Actually it's a look by itself. So.